Hi there, Rick Young here. I just wanted to do a quick video on, on how to add a demo account to your MT4 platform. Now, I will tell you this, I'm using an Android device, so it may, might be slightly different than on your, on your iPhone if that's what you're using. So keep that in mind. So when you first log into MT4, and, and let's say you have already have set this up already, you, the first screen you're going to come to is the symbols, the pairing, okay, where all the, where the, all the pairs are. All right, to create a demo account, you're going to have to, uh, there's two ways to get to the menu. One, you can take your finger and slide from left to right, and it opens up this menu, right, to where that you can access this part right here. Or you can click on the top left-hand side here, and then it opens it up as well. And what right now, what it's saying is I am currently logged into my crypto demo account, okay? So what you can do is you go to Manage. Now here's all your, all your accounts if you have, you know, if you have one or two. Or if you just have one, you only have one listed. So, to, so uh, the point of, of doing this, and it, by the way, it, it tells you whether they're real accounts or demo. Now, I also want you to pay attention because I'm going to talk about this in a second, where all of them have Richard Young. So this can get very complicated until I figured out how I can actually name these accounts to where I know which accounts. So when I'm switching between the two, I know which strategy or what how to trade on those specific accounts. Okay, so keep that in mind. All right, so if uh, if I want to add an account, I'm going to click this plus sign. I'm going to come here to open personal demo account. I if you've already, which you should already, if you've already logged in your MT4, it should show your demo server. Okay, but if not, find your broker, and then what you're going to do is you're going to select your um, your server name so that you can trade against that server. Here's where it's going to have all your personal information. Now here it's going to show your name. Okay, so mine initially had Richard Young, Richard Young, Richard Young, whatever. I found that you can actually, uh, and again, this is only a demo account, so you can name it whatever you want. So let's say I want to use this because I want to demo the strategy, uh, ATM strategy, and I want to just demo only ATM on this so that I can get a feel for how it works, right? If you demo a bunch of different strategies on one account, you really won't get a feel for how it works for you. So I would suggest opening a demo for every strategy. Um, and then over here, uh, here's where you can choose your deposit. Uh, the lowest you can go is 3,000. I wish it would go much lower because you really don't get a feel, like a, a real live feel for the people who have smaller accounts. Um, I wish it would go lower, but it doesn't. And then you can also change your leveraging here if you want. Uh, I normally do one to 200. And then that's it. You click Create. And what it's going to do, it's going to pop up very briefly of what a password is and all that good stuff. Um, but let's say, from now on, you don't have to remember the password. But if you were to uninstall this and wanted to add it again, you need to know that password. So where is that password at? If you slide the window, you come down here to mailbox, you click on it, and it says new account registration. You click on it here, and there you go. Here is your the account name and the password, and I don't know what the investor part is. It really doesn't matter. As long as you know the password and the account number, you can log in um, either when you're reinstalling MT4 or maybe doing it on online. Okay. Um, going back here, and that's how you add an account. So now I'm currently logged into the ATM strategy account. That's how you add a demo.